when you combine the heat with the humidity, it is humid out there. It's sticky, and heat index values are in the upper 80s to around 90 degrees. And that is helping to kick off a few isolated showers and thunderstorms, especially across the far north. As we zoom in here just a little bit closer, you can see that we do have a severe thunderstorm warning up for central Menominee County, Michigan. The storm is dropping to the south at around 15 miles per hour. It does have the potential to produce damaging winds of 60 miles per hour and also some nickel size hail, along with frequent cloud to ground lightning and torrential downpours. If you are in the path of this storm, you need to seek shelter immediately. Now, as you take a look at the high-res future radar, you can see those thunderstorms will be dropping to the south and southwest here as we progress through the afternoon and the evening. The best chance for th uh, seeing thunderstorms will be north and west of the Fox Valley across Marinette County, Oconto County, over into Menominee County and Shawano County. And we're going to have to watch these storms because all those severe weather is not uh, in the forecast at this time by the Storm Prediction Center, obviously we already have a severe thunderstorm warning that has been issued, and uh, any one of these storms that develop over the next three to six hours could potentially be on the strong to severe side with locally heavy downpours. The satellite picture shows mostly sunny skies across the state of Wisconsin, except for where we have those showers and thunderstorms now popping up across the far north and northeastern sections of the state up in the UP. It's a very warm to hot day across the the central part of the country. Temperatures right now mainly in the 80s and lower 90s. And this heat is going to continue to build here as we make our way through the next three days or 